What up, squad? It is currently January 29th. It is 2.44 in the morning. I told you guys that I was going to tell you guys the truth and let you guys know what's going on. Well, I haven't uploaded in a lot of videos because I've been in a very bad place mentally for months now. I don't even know how many. I just know that they haven't been good. And I got to a point where I didn't really care about myself or even what I was doing, what I was putting into my body. I didn't keep moving and working out. I would just kind of gave up. Um, and... I'm tired of letting life just keep passing me by and not doing anything about it to change it. <clears throat> kind of feel like I've been, I hit rock bottom and I'm just <laughs> trying to get myself out of that. But motivating myself has been extremely difficult when I just... I haven't really liked who I've been seeing in the mirror lately. So, I make TikTok videos because I have fun doing them. And they're helping me to feel better about myself. But, I don't want to only be uploading stuff like that. Because you guys have been there through, you guys have been here with me through everything, the ups and the downs. So, I'm trusting you guys, letting you guys in, because I just haven't been in the very best place. And I'm trying to correct that now. It's only recently that I started pulling myself back together and started trying to change myself again and uh, just find who I was and who I know I can be and just find my strength again. I used to get on here and I used to upload enough positive videos about telling people how I cope with my depression and my anxiety and the things that I do to help myself not feel like it's an unimaginable battle, climb, whatever you want to say it is, and I don't know, there's just been a lot of things that have made me doubt who I am, and uh, I've really been just struggling, and uh, Again, I didn't care about what I was doing to myself. And I... I went to the doctors last week, and as scary as this is to admit, I can't keep hiding. Because it's not going to change if I don't do something about it. My current weight is... 640 pounds, and I'm d disappointed in myself, but I'm trying to forgive myself so that I can move on from it and I can start going back in the direction that I need to go. <sighs> I have some days where I just don't even want to do anything. I don't want to get up. I just want to sleep. I want people to just leave me alone. And uh, I don't like being that person. <sighs> I like being the person that can bring a smile to somebody's face. 
I like being the person that people feel comfortable around. And for a really long time, I haven't even felt comfortable with myself. So I'm working on that right now. I am talking to my therapist about it. And uh, we usually I go into therapy once a week. But because I've been struggling so much lately, I'm currently going to be going in one time for a full session and then a half session a week now just so that I can start trying to get myself back to where I feel comfortable being myself again because, like, where I'm currently at... I don't even like really like leaving my house, but I do it when I have to, and I don't want to be like this anymore. I used to be so, just not even that long ago, I used to be so just uh, ready to go and just like went out the door without any fear or any of that, and uh, the more I started doubting myself... The more I started caring less, and uh, I have to get rid of that doubt, and that's what I'm working on now. And the first step for that is telling you guys what's really going on, so now you guys know where I'm at. I hope you guys can understand that uh, I'm already beating myself up about this, and I'm trying not to, and I'm trying to forgive myself, but... It's hard because we're our own, we're, we are our own worst critics. And, uh... I'm really just trying not to... Hurt myself as much anymore because... I just blame myself for a lot of things. And I just feel like there's a lot of pressure on me from a lot of different angles. And a lot of different people. And, uh... I just collapsed under that pressure of everything that was going on. And I really don't want to make excuses because ultimately it's my choice. I did this to myself. I don't blame anybody but myself. And that's where all of it needs to be is on me. Because I'm the one that chose to not care about myself. To keep doing what I was doing. But now you guys know, and I hope you guys understand. <sighs> I don't want to keep making videos where all I can do is cry. I want to make videos where I'm smiling and I'm telling you guys about what I do to get through the day with a smile on my face. <sighs> So, I'm currently trying to get back a semblance in my life. And, uh, I hope you guys want to be here for the next parts of my life. I hope you guys understand. I'll try and upload when I can. But I have to be in the right place mentally to feel okay with uploading and... Face whatever ridicule or things people are going to say because it's one of the reasons why I haven't put an, a video up there because, like, most of you guys are so amazing. You guys get into the comment section and you guys leave me nothing but positive responses and everything else like that. And so much love, but I don't know what it is, but it's like, as much love as there is, there'll be like one negative comment, and that's the only one that seems to stick out to me. I don't know why, but that's how it is, and I'm really working on trying not to let other people's opinions of me get in the way, because ultimately my opinion of myself is what matters, but my opinion of myself right now isn't very good. <sighs> So, I am trying to change that. I'm trying to be the person I know I can be. 
and who I've been in the past. Use this situation to grow and to come back stronger than ever. I hope you guys understand, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.